Good morning, welcome to your 10 a.m. daily weather briefing. Okay, in our current surface analysis today, not too much to talk about in our immediate area today. We're going to be continuing to see those well above normal temperatures, relatively light winds, and not going to be seeing too much precipitation in our area today. However, we are going to be monitoring this low pressure system as it continues to move east today and tomorrow, bringing with it some chances for some rain showers tomorrow as well as some elevated winds for our area. Take a look at the upper level wind chart today at 1,000 feet, winds coming out of the southwest at 18 knots, increasing all the way up to 65 knots, coming out of the west at 25,000 feet. And our freezing level today is 11,600 feet. Looking at our physical satellite imagery today, we see mostly cloudy conditions in our area. We're going to be continuing to see these mostly cloudy to overcast conditions throughout the remainder day and into tomorrow morning. Take a look at our composite reflectivity today as we move throughout the next 24 hours. Again, expected to stay dry in our area. As we push into Friday morning, we're going to be seeing those showers start to move into our area. As we pick back up on our long-term forecast model again, Friday morning, seeing those showers start to approach our area. It's going to be pretty rainy for us during the daytime hours of Friday, some elevated winds as well. Once that cold front moves through, we're going to be seeing those temperatures drop pretty substantially to really just bringing us back to some more seasonable temperatures compared to what we've been seeing. Definitely going to be seeing a colder day uh, in terms of temperatures on Saturday. Continuing into Sunday, we're going to be seeing that high pressure uh, hang out in our on Sunday with the chance for a slight shower very late in the evening on Sunday into Monday morning. As for next week, that's kind of how the same story goes. Just some very slight chances of some rainfall, particularly during the evening hours of Monday and Tuesday, as well as Tuesday into Wednesday. Looking at our 24 hour weather risk chart today mostly cloudy to overcast conditions throughout the next 24 hours. Temperatures today started off at 51 degrees, seeing 55 degrees right now. Looking at a high uh, today around 67 or so, going to be well above normal as our average high for today is only 47 degrees. Same goes for our overnight low, looking at a low around 58 tonight when our average low for today is only 31. So still seeing these well above normal winds today start off really nice and light out of the south at 2 to 5 knots, uh, picking up just a bit to uh, these winds at 5 to 10 knots. Uh, Going to be starting to gust up a little bit as we move into the afternoon, about 19 knots, uh, and then going to be seeing those wind gusts continue to increase as we move into Friday morning, becoming southwesterly winds knots Friday morning, gusting up to about 25 knots. And our tides for today are normal. Today again, still well above normal in terms of our temperatures with a high around 67, mostly cloudy to overcast conditions expected. Tomorrow we're going to be seeing some rain showers during the day, windy conditions as well. We're going to be seeing that daytime high dropping pretty shortly after that front moves through uh, during the early afternoon hours. So uh, high around 62 on Friday, we're going to be seeing a low we move into Friday night to Saturday morning of only 27, so pretty substantial drop in our temperatures once that front moves through. Saturday, we're going to be seeing mainly sunny conditions, high only around 47. It's actually seasonable for this time of year, although it doesn't look like it as we continue throughout the next seven days, seeing those temperatures rise up again to the mid-50s to the upper 60s. As we move into next week, as we can see Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, just have these slight chances of rainfall, uh, particularly during the overnight hours. Otherwise, we're going to be seeing mostly fairly cloudy conditions during those days. Highs around 60 or maybe the upper 50s. That's going to conclude our 10 a.m. daily weather briefing. We'll be back again tomorrow at 8.15 at 10 a.m. Hope you guys have a great day.